everybody, Alistair Darmac Dawes here and welcome back to my channel. And today we are in the National Maritime Museum in Falmouth. And I've just done a video of coming up from Penzance to Falmouth. Well, Penzance, Truer than Falmouth. And uh, yeah, so we'll do a video or two around here and I'll take some photos and I'll put like a collage video as well. Just to get some more content out on this channel. I haven't uploaded in like two months so I do apologise about that. But let's just go around and see what's here. Okay, rock climber sort of security thingy. I would not like to climb that, that is sure. Look at the sports raft. Another sports raft climbs. Yeah, so it's just here. Let's take a photo of that. So what's that? Two children, 38 days. That is mental in that. This is what they had, is it? Shark teeth, pressure cooker weight, turtle oil, ugh. Minging. Take a photo of that though. Didn't mean to stop it there. <laughs> Hey, that is mental. The quack. Are you meant to go this way? Is there like a, a way you're meant to go? London 2012. Whoa, that's pretty cool. What's this about? Curator's cabin? Cabinet, is that how you say it? Why do I get really weird vibes from these? So are these original paintings? I get weird vibes from them. No disrespect, guys. 2012. The Olympics of London. So, like an information thing, my Bob. Big raft. That's it, the Xander. That's it. Uh, Reputation and artist design in well. Yeah, oh, the water good. rag. Oh, I can't read. <laughs> What's this here? Bloody hell, that's a tiny thing. But that's it. That's the actual video of it. Well, not sinking, but. I don't know, did it sink? so tiny, how do you even get in that? Uh, Actwood, 45, don't know what that means. Little engine. Yeah, there you go, look. Jeez. So that's what it is. Hydroplane. So we've also got this here. That's like a... Uh, oh, whatever that is called. I'm not very good at maritime stuff, I do apologise. What does it say here? Super dishes. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, if you want to read that, if you want to pause it, go ahead. And, yeah. So it's like a... Uh, Another great big raft up above. Well, two actually. Uh, Swift or something. We go around there. Well, these are the old boat building tools. What the tools work. So you've got a craftsman's uh, draw knife, a hammer, an axe, a Viking boat builder would. Chesla or something like that. I will take photos of these later on, actually, so if I just step back a minute. Future Alistair, take a photo of that. So, yeah. Take a photo of it the other side as well. 
That's the dock, the actual dock in real life. Beautiful. Yeah, if you try to take a photo of that. And that as well. Four P, does that mean four people? I'm guessing. No, yeah, they're even workshopping there. I'll go around in a sec. This is how they would build boats look. Literally our trunks. The canoe. That's how they would literally build it. And there's a game. Wow. Excellent. These are again. I don't know, a few trailers to take a photo of these. I'll go up and around in a sec. Step back. Modern tools. We'll go all the way back, modern tools. When the tools started to get older. That's literally how they'll build them. Like that. And that looked like it was dug up. Look at that. That's literally how they'll build boats. That's a shell on a stick, essentially. Ancient craft. I've already got a thumbnail for this already, so uh, it's pretty good. That's what, developing wood. So that's what, 60s, 50s, maybe earlier. More modern tools with carbon fibre and um, other boat building materials. Uh, yeah, carbon fibre, there we go. So we've got some tools here. State of the art. Very nice. I'm not going to go into the library because I'm not really a reader. So a few trailers to take a photo of that, if I can zoom out, there we are. So this is the workshop, boats under repair, core sand, I used to live there, well, almost. Jeez. Just saying I could have gone in, well, I was almost going into the uh, boat building industry, but I moved back to Penzance, so, yeah. Support the worker, donate £3, no thank you. That ship there, this one here, it goes to Plymouth quite regularly. Uh, what number is it? L3000, yeah, it goes to Plymouth quite regularly. And this is the time lapse of them building it. Pretty cool. So another RLMI raft. So this is how they would save people nowadays, look. That there. You can go that speed. Take a photo of that future on the start. Take a photo of that as well, future on the start. Jeez, that's a lot of money down there. That's like an old raft. What does it say here? Father's Day. Yeah, it's an old raft, that is. A secret name of a famous tender. Hmm. What does it say there? Very nice. Okay, so let's go in here. And of course we see an octopus. The Quacken. Whoa. Pretty cool. Like a great big map. I'm not gonna read it, I'm not gonna go into that. Malarkey. Oh, uh, well, you go around. What's this here? Take a future take a photo of that future Alistair. It say please do not touch okay that's like a female or something uh young finn oh it's a young finn uh, well
No, thank you. <laughs> Why am I getting really weird camera thing if I'm going to point out towards it? So look, it's interfering. Hmm. An old glue. Miracles of nature that have astounded. Yes, no, thank you. Big these books are. Don't see these nowadays. Image of mermaid. What's this here? Why do they put like a DVD? No, don't know. I believe in the Kraken. Oh my god, they've actually got a Wolverine. God, that, that looks like it's original as well. So we've got, that looks like it's in, oh my god, that's an actual fish. Ooh. Does it say what it is? Oh. Yeah, that there, there. India. tools what they'll use. Don't know if you try to take a photo of that again. This is what it would have been like in an old wherever it used to be. If you try to take a photo of that, I can get back far enough. If you guys want to take some photos of this as well, please go ahead. You know, I'm sharing this with you guys, so it'll be quite nice. And I'm not time lapsing it this time, so it'll be quite nice. Yeah, take any photos you want. So you've got HMS Challenger. Take a photo of that if you want. I'm not lying you. There we are. So you've got HMS Challenger model. Those creepy noises. Oh my god, that's an old film that is. That's an old sum submarine or something, probably. Uh, that's what they would use to go on, go on down deep depths. These are actual real animals. That's amazing. Yeah, look at that. Ugly mofo. Creepy. If you told us to take a photo of that. There you go. Creepy. Right, I'm just going to pause it here so because my battery's about to die. Okay, so you come to this at the end of the corridor. So, uh, I will actually do you know what I'm going to. If he moves his head, I'm going to scream. So, give me a sec. I'll show you that photo in a sec. So, uh, yeah. Got a great big goose. Uh, Swan goose hybrid. That's what they're calling that. Take a photo if you want. Yeah, I do not believe that, I'm sorry. That's a little bull. Don't believe in that neither, don't believe in mermaids one bit, that's been made. Sorry. Don't believe in that. Take a photo of it. Any anything if you want guys. Take a photo of that if you want. If you believe in mermaids, let me know down in the comments. 
Oh, I don't. I'm sorry. Go with femur bone. Or... Why am I obsessed with femur bones? I don't know. What's that? Albatross, that's it. An albatross? Sorry, Birmingham accent. Take a photo of anything if you want, guys. Take a photo of it both. Uh, whatever that is. Big cat. Jawbone, I think. Whatever that is. Finding the beast. Beast of Bodmin Moor. Oh, the Beast of Bodmin Moor. Why is that in the Maritime Museum? I don't know. Weird heads in there. Ugh. Okay, loads of money in there. Okay. Okay, so you go into this area, which is at the bottom floor, because the rest of it is just tribal and all that, a load of bollocks, but there we are. So there's some more actual maritime stuff. The sail makers, that's all sail maker stuff. That's amazing how they've done that. Sail loft. It's amazing how they've done that in those days. It really is. It's amazing. It's all about that. Take a photo of that if you want, guys. If I just move back. There we are, you can take a photo of all that now. And that if you wanted to. So this is how they would go out and catch fish and lobsters and crabs and... Yeah, it's pretty amazing how they done it in those days. What's that there? Uh, Helston. So that was made in Helston in... Toy... What does that say? Toy and Co. I don't know. Number, number one. So is it? I'm going to take a photo of that if you can, if you want to. There we are. Take a photo of that as well. Not a lot of creators allow you to do that. But, because I'm different. Me, I love history. So there we are. Load of barrels, fish barrels by the looks of it. And I'm pretty hungry, so I'm gonna get going in a sec. Because I'm hungry. Is that enough? That's a, like a very first engine. Look. You know what? If I step back, take a picture of all of that together. There we are. Yeah, a few trials to take a photo of that, I just show. Yeah. Okay, so that's the Maritime Museum. So I hope you like what I'm doing. If you like what I'm doing, smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, punch that subscribe button. Um, I hope you enjoyed the tour around the National Maritime Museum. And I'll see you in, an in another video if I can speak English. Cheers, guys.